It's what we feared, COVID-19 attacking our most vulnerable populations. This morning, Austin Public Health announced 26 residents in nursing and assisted living facilities have died in Travis County. And we learned from family members that a resident at a Round Rock nursing home was among the eight total deaths in Williamson County. The Round Rock Trinity Care Center was identified as Williamson County's first nursing home cluster over the weekend. And KXAN's Caitlin Carmuth found out today Williamson County is tracking an outbreak at a second nursing home facility. This morning, I believe in our uh, notice, we made you aware of our seventh uh, fatality uh, to COVID-19. And unfortunately, uh, just a few moments ago, we had our eighth death as well, too. One of the latest, 69-year-old Sue DeLeon. Her family confirmed she passed away early Tuesday morning due to COVID-19 complications. She'd been hospitalized since Sunday morning. Saturday, Williamson County announced the COVID-19 outbreak inside the nursing home where she was living. As county judge, I am uh, heartbroken uh, for the families and for their loss. De Leon was one of the 50 residents and staff members to test positive at the Trinity Care Facility. Williamson County health officials say all results have since come in for more than 200 people tested. Our, our senior adults, again, are our most precious resource, and we will use the reasonable means necessary to protect them. Meanwhile, there's been a second outbreak at a separate facility. We're working really hard uh, to protect uh, the lives of the individuals that are there. And, and in fact, we took the extraordinary step of testing every single resident and, and employee and during the middle of the night. And it's a rush to secure a safe haven for those affected. Williamson County opened up a wing inside the Hearthstone Nursing and Rehabilitation Center to serve as an isolation facility at the beginning of April. 33 rooms are available, according to the facility. To date, 17 units are occupied, with incoming patients from both Williamson and Travis County. Caitlin Carmo, KXAN News. Williamson County has not confirmed the name of the first or second facility cluster. It's also unclear if the eighth death in Williamson County is a result of the nursing home cluster. Also, if necessary, Judge Gravel did announce the ability to open up a second isolation facility. Last month, Governor Greg Abbott signed an executive order banning visitors from nursing homes unless it was to provide critical assistance. On April 25th, Trinity Care Center said it had been following for those rules for the last two weeks, but based off of those dates, they should have been doing so for more than a month.